welcome to my YouTube channel or welcome back to my YouTube channel if you've been here before. Uh, my name is Sheridan and this is the Q&A that literally nobody has for. Uh, a couple people did ask me questions mainly because I specifically asked you guys to ask me questions on my Instagram. Um, if you're not following me here, my handle is here. Um, also, since we're throwing out tags, tags? Is that the word that I'm looking for? Oh God, okay, <laughs> anyway, brain's not working. Instagram, TikTok. Check me out if you haven't already. Anyway, let's get into the questions. So first question, what's it like being me? Oh my God, I'm so glad you asked. I which movie did you la uh, did you watch last? So the last movie that I watched was actually Uncharted. And if you haven't seen that, let's just say it's a lot better if you were not sober. <laughs> YouTube, I'm 21, okay? Don't, don't strike me, okay? What are your followers called? So my followers are actually called Cherries. I don't know if anybody knows that or not, but I, I did name you guys Cherries. So in my intro page, it says, uh, Welcome Mon Chéri. Mon Chéri translates, and I'm probably butchering that, but it's French for my dear. Cherry is like a, it's a play on my name, and then it's a play on cherries. Like mon chéri, cherry, you get it. Um, anyway, so you guys are called cherries. So if you hear me refer to you as cherries, or if you hear me say something about cherries, that's you guys, so. Would you rather live in a submarine or an airplane? What kind of a question is that? <laughs> what? Uh, submarine or an airplane? Okay, so. There's a couple things here that we could say. So for an airplane, you've got all of that pressure, but I guess you already have, you have a lot of that pressure in a submarine too. Okay, pros and cons. Con for a submarine, you're underwater, you never see the fucking light of day, so that doesn't sound fun at all. Airplane, you at least get to see the light of day. I also feel like it would be much, it'd be much more fun to live in an airplane than a airplane. We're gonna pick airplane. I'm not gonna ramble. Airplane it is. Lukewarm or ice water? What kind of question is that? Ice water? Who drinks lukewarm water? Oh God, no, no, no. Comment down below which one you pick. Lukewarm or ice water. What animal do you resemble? What animal do I resemble? I have no idea. <laughs> what do you think? Comment down below. What animal do I resemble? Uh, what animal do I resemble? A cat? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the pointy ears. I don't, I don't know. Do you edit your own videos? I do edit my own videos. Uh, it, it is a pain in the ass, but I do edit my own videos, yes. Do you consume a lot of caffeine? Define a lot. What is, what is a lot? Because somebody who doesn't drink a lot of caffeine, probably, uh, versus somebody who does drink a lot of caffeine, probably not. Um, I have seen a girl on TikTok, I do not remember her name, I'm so sorry for this, but I remember a girl that's on TikTok and she makes an entire cup of coffee out of her kitchen sink. I am not quite at that level yet, um, and I hope to never be, because if I am, somebody needs to check on me because I am not okay. <laughs> Did you pass the driver's test on the first try? Okay, so funny story. I actually, so in high school we had a, it was basically like a driver's ed class that you could take in high school. And my mother was so afraid of me getting in a car accident that she made me take that class. I don't know if she made me, but I think the incentive was that if I took that class, I didn't have to take the actual driver's test when you get your license. It was like a free whatever. I got a free pass on the driver's test that I didn't have to take the driver's test. So technically, yes. If we want story time here, uh, so basically one of those times that I was in the driver's test, they had somebody who was like licensed to give driver's tests to children or to teenagers, I guess. And one time, so I did it twice because you had two, you could have two tries. And it was towards the end of the class, so you were supposed to know how to like parallel park, you're supposed to know how to drive, like you're supposed to like be well versed in the driving, right? So we go out in the road and I had never been driving on like an actual road, like an actual like busy road, not necessarily a highway, but I've never driven on like a busy road before and he took me immediately on the busy road and I was so nervous. 
I should not have passed the first time. I don't know why he took pity on me and he passed me the first time. And then he actually passed me the second time for real, for real. You're the driver, but the guy in the passenger side is the guy who's giving you the test. He has his own brake on his side of the on his side of the car, so he can basically say like when it is that he is like if you need an extra push or an extra break, he can give that to you, right? He had to use the brake because I almost I okay. I was going slow, so I wasn't gonna hit him, but I didn't gauge the distance between me and the car in front of me, and it was like a parked car. Anyway, how many countries have you been to? How many countries have I been to? I've been to a lot of countries. Uh, I, mm. I wanna say 13. 12 or 13? I don't remember exactly. It's a lot though. Um, that was my graduation present to myself was to travel the world, or travel, not travel the world, but travel to a bunch of countries. Have you ever met a celebrity? I have technically not met a celebrity, although Tiger Woods and I made eye contact one time, so I'm counting that. <laughs> what was your favorite TV show growing up? Uh, Kim Possible, and I should have known that I was by way before this because uh, my favorite show was Kim Possible, not because of anything other than Kim, because she's hot. And then there was a couple other movies and shows that I should have known because I didn't like the main character. I liked the female supporting actress. So. <laughs> what made you start YouTube? So I actually was in a very toxic relationship prior to where I am now. Basically that person told me like, something along the lines of, I don't know what you're gonna film, or like you're not gonna be able to film anything or something like that. And I was like, haha, prove you wrong. So here I am proving him wrong. <laughs> what is your favorite TV show? So my current favorite TV show is definitely Sandman on Netflix. If you haven't watched it, go watch it. It's not for everybody. It can be a little gory, just to warn you but it's a fantastic TV show, Hi, 10 out of 10, highly recommend it. Who's your favorite actor? Oof. Comedy wise, Ryan, uh, Ryan Reynolds, love his work. Before he passed, I would say it was Robin Williams. What was your favorite childhood toy? Boppets, I freaking loved Boppets. I couldn't get past like the 10th round, but I loved them. How many shoes do you have? Not many. Maybe like 10? I really don't have that many. I wear one shoe until they fall apart and then I go get another pair. What is your astrological sign? Well, uh, I was born January 15th, so that makes me a pause for dramatic effect. Capricorn. That's right, I'm the goat. Wait, right? Am I? Is the Capricorn a goat? Yes, 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 I, I am the goat, yes. Uh, also uh, depicted as a sea goat. So take that as you will. So apparently my camera did not record any of my outros, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. If you guys did enjoy watching this video, go ahead and like the video. If you uh, did have another question for me or if you have an answer for any of the questions that I asked, go ahead and comment those down below. If you have not subscribed already, please do subscribe. It does help out the channel quite a bit. If you guys have any questions for me, go ahead and leave them in the comments and I'll try my best to answer them. And if you want me to do this type of video again, let me know because uh, I, I had some fun with it. Anyway, um, I try and post new videos every Friday and I will see you guys next week. Bye.